Now, today's top stories and Power of 5 weather from News 5, sponsored by Akron Children's Hospital. Hi, I'm Rob Powers with your top stories. Big developments tonight in the state's promise to ramp up COVID-19 testing. Governor Mike DeWine announced plans to mobilize Ohio's 15,000 pharmacists to conduct that testing. And Ohio is now updating its testing priorities as we attain more capacity. Before, only those who were in high-risk groups were recommended for testing. That included people over 65, healthcare workers, or those who were hospitalized. Now it's been expanded to include Ohioans who may be low-risk but do have symptoms. This is all in an effort to keep them from spreading the virus through their community. Governor DeWine says guidance for amusement parks and zoos could all be coming next week. Ahead of that announcement, the company that owns Cedar Point says it's updating its app to take reservations to enter the park and give guests a time-constrained entry voucher. The app will also be able to be used for contactless payments. All guests who enter the park would be subject to a health check. Another big story tonight, the ever-changing weather. Hello, Mark. Sir, 75 degrees for your high tomorrow, but we've got a strong line of thunderstorms coming through during the afternoon hours and then much cooler air behind that. You're talking 60s through the weekend. Sponsored by Akron Children's Hospital.